Hi everyone. So welcome back to another short episode. Today I'm going to tell you a very important topic, which is um, how do you identify the intrauterine devices? Which device is it? Is it a copper T3 ATA? Is it Mirena? Is it Progesta Surd? Is it Lippies Loops? I'll tell you the identification features of all that. Before we begin, I'm Dr. Neha, as you uh, might be knowing me, your mentor and guide for PSM on Unacademy. For my lectures, you can refer to my Unacademy profile. If you take the plus subscription on Unacademy, you'll get an opportunity to choose the best from the best. You can get an access to both live and recorded classes. You can compete in live tests and quizzes, study on any device of your choice, access a QBank with more than 25,000 plus questions, and very soon we are coming out with printed notes as well. Special classes are held by educators on the apps. You can download the app, attend these free classes where uh, they are interactive in nature. We have leaderboard challenges. You can um, join in the class from anywhere participate in live quizzes also we have an updated and highly effective question bank with more than 25,000 questions the batches that have just started on 25th of august are some of the important batches like an fmg batch course a next 2022 batch and a neat pg 21 emergency room mcqs batch so you can definitely become a part of these batch courses you can use my code psm10 and get a 10 percent off next free grand test is happening on the 28th of august and every morning on an academy at 9 a.m on the an academy app i'm taking a last minute revision for most important topics of psm tomorrow it is biostats and also every day at 4 30 pm on an academy youtube channel we are doing these quiz uh, we are doing these image based sessions so next is national health programs you can definitely follow this okay guys now look at this contraceptive what is this what is this? We are just going to study the identification features of intrauterine devices. Okay, so what is this one? If you look at this, of course, you can make out that this is an IUD. But which one is it? Is it copper T380A? Is it something else? Here, I'm just going to write for you. This is copper T380A. All right. This is a plain copper T, but which one is it? Copper T 380A. Now, why did I say it is copper T 380A? Because it has copper wire wound on the vertical on the horizontal stem. Okay, it has copper wire wound on the horizontal stem as well as it has it on the vertical stem. I'll be showing you the distinguishing features as we proceed. Now, that was the type of question which can come in your exams. Let's start with the identification features of first generation intrauterine device so what is this first generation intrauterine device this is a lippies loop everybody all right this has a very high failure rate it is a first generation a loop kind of thing a curve kind of thing no longer in use before we go to the um, this thing the mechanism of action let's talk about this what is this this is a Grafenberg ring everybody Grafenberg ring also is a first generation intrauterine device all right this is also a first generation intrauterine device which is no longer used at the end i'll be showing you the mechanism of action of intrauterine devices also now coming to this second generation so when you talk the first generations are inert now when you look at this second generation intrauterine device you can see that copper wire is wound on this vertical on this horizontal stem and also on the vertical stem and it is completely straight t shaped with copper wire both on the horizontal as well as the vertical stem that's how you're going to recognize a copper t 380a now what is this 380 and what is this a so i'll just tell you 380 मतलब क्या होता है? 380 मिलीमीटर स्क्वायर ऑफ कॉपर वायर इस वूंड ऑन स्टेम्स विथ एक्स्ट्रा कॉपर स्लीव्स ऑन बोथ आर्म्स ऑफ टी। ये जो ए होता है ना गाइस, ए इंडिकेट्स द आर्म्स, ऑल राइट। आल्सो ए इंडिकेट्स द साइज, ऑल राइट। साइज हो सकता है ए बी सी डी, डी इस द बिगेस्ट साइज। द लाइफ स्पैन at the bottom of the stem. This reduces the risk of perforation and reduces cramp-like pain. So you could be asked, what are the numbers? Number represent the surface area of copper in millimeter square on the device. This size is like B, C, D. They represent the size of intrauterine device. D is the largest size. And also if I say copper T 380A or AG, all right, that is silver or gold, which is wound. So for copper T 380A, copper wire, aapka horizontal stem may be a 
वर्टिकल स्टेम में भी है पूरी टी शेप में नाउ लुक एट दिस दिस इज अ कर्व टी शेप कैन यू सी एंड द कॉपर वायर इज ओनली ऑन दिस वर्टिकल स्टेम ऑल राइट कॉपर वायर सिर्फ इज वर्टिकल स्टेम में एवरी वन वॉट इज दिस नाउ वॉट इज दिस कॉल्ड दिस इज नोवा टी ओके सो नोवा टी क्या होता है कॉपर टी थ्री सेवेंटी नोवा टी इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ठीक है दिस वन look over here this is nova tea you can have copper tea 375 also you can have 380 also nova tea 380 also but the important thing is nova tea is a curved hota hai aur copper wire is sirf vertical stem mein hota hai and it has a shelf life of 5 years what is this this already has the letter in it u so u shaped ho gaya multi load can you see this u ban gaya multi load copper wire is sirf vertical stem mein that is what is multi load okay Very very वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट मल्टीलोड कॉपर थ्री सेवेंटी फाइव है विच इज इंपॉर्टेंट दिस हैज बिन लाइसेंस टू बी यूज फॉर फाइव ईयर्स एंड इट हैज ट्वाइस एज लाइकली टू रिजल्ट इन प्रेगनेंसी फेलियर रेट इसकी ज्यादा होती है बट सिमिलर एक्सपल्शन रेट है ओके सो वॉट हैव बी सीन सो फार कॉपर टी थ्री एट्टी ए में कंप्लीट टी शेप्ड कॉपर वायर ऑन हॉरिजोंटल एंड वर्टिकल स्टेम फॉर नोवा टी विच हैज सिल्वर वूंट टू इट ओके दैट इज a curve one copper wire only present on the vertical stem multi load mein it's u shape that is copper t 375 now look over here everyone what is this a white colored this thing ye puri tarah white hai with no copper wire theek hai white curve with no copper wire theek hai white curve with no copper wire over here so what is this everyone this is myrena all right one of the most important intra uterine device levonorgestrel 20 this is what this is a third generation intra uterine device okay third generation intra uterine device hai. this is levonorgestrel iucd okay so same thing this is lng 20 releases 20 microgram of levonorgestrel every day so this is myrena all right this releases 20 microgram of levonorgestrel every day causes endometrial atrophy alters stroma to inhibit implantation so What is this? देखो ऐसे कर्व कंप्लीटली वाइट इट इज लिवोनॉर्जेस्ट्रल ट्वेंटी और माइरीना ओके सो कैन यू आइडेंटिफाई दिस कॉपर वायर टी शेप्ड कॉपर टी थ्री एट्टी ए ये क्या है आपका जी कर्व है वाइट शेप्ड है दिस इज माइरीना लिवोनॉर्जेस्ट्रल ट्वेंटी एंड इफ यू लुक ओवर हियर वॉट इज दिस दिस इज प्रोजेस्टा सर्ट प्रोजेस्टा सर्ट इज कंप्लीटली वाइट okay but it is straight white it's not a curve and this releases 64 microgram of progesterone every day shelf life of these important properties 380a for 10 years all right nova t could be asked for 5 years progesterone releasing iud progesta cert every year levonorgestrel iud 5 to 7 years and one golden point iud expulsion rate lowest is with progesta cert highest is with lipies lu removal rate bhi lowest hai progesta cert ke sath highest levonorgestrel ke sath hai but jo pregnancy rate hai something which it's meant to prevent unwanted pregnancies that is lowest with levonorgestrel highest is with lipies loop okay so how are you going to uh, identify i'm going to sum it up for you first generation mein lipies loop grafenberg ring hai सेकेंड जनरेशन में कॉपर कंटेनिंग डिवाइसेज है सो इफ यू लुक एट कॉपर कंटेनिंग डिवाइसेज अ टी शेप कंप्लीट टी शेप विथ कॉपर वायर ऑन द वर्ट हॉरिजोंटल एज वेल एज वर्टिकल स्टेल कॉपर टी थ्री एटी ए अगर कर्व्ड है विथ कॉपर वायर ओनली ऑन द वर्टिकल स्टेम नोवा टी विच हैज सिल्वर मेटल अटैच टू इट एंड इफ इट इज मल्टी लोड कॉपर टी थ्री सेवेंटी फाइव इट्स यू शेप लाइक दिस माइरीना में पूरी तरह वाइट है कर्वी वाइट है ऑल राइट नो कॉपर वायर प्रोजेस्टर सर्ट इज स्ट्रेट लाइक अ टी कंप्लीटली व्हाइट एंड कलर मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन जस्ट वांटेड टू शो यू वंस अगेन मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन एवरीबॉडी ऑफ द जस्ट अ सेकंड यस we'll just quickly see yes foreign body reaction they act as biochemical changes in endometrium reduce chance of fertilization coppers in iud enhance cellular response in endometrium alter cervical mucus affecting sperm motility capacitation survival and also hormonal containing iud's make endometrium unfavorable to implantation okay this is very very important identification of intrauterine devices many times an image based question has come on this thank you so much for what